turning. Oh, I said I was not gonna yawn anymore on camera, so let's take that again. Good morning. The hair thing? Okay, take three. Good morning. Wow, I literally got my glasses stuck in my hair. Oh, they fall off. Um, it's Saturday morning. It is Vita day. Oh my gosh. I think eight or nine. Mm, the correct one is right there. <laughs> um, I'm, I've just been laying in bed, chilling. It's like 10. I woke up at like 7.38 and that was sleeping in for me because I have to wake up so early for work. Um, now I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna go have brunch with my grandma and my aunt and little baby. Um, and I am going to remember to take you guys along. So, yes. Um, so, welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a great day, great morning, great night, wherever you are. And um, thanks for spending the day with me. Let's go have brunch. <laughs> having brunch. Uh -oh. I remembered. <laughs> This is a place that Ani and I used to come to during the shutdown. And we would get our food and go to the local park to eat and have a little picnic. Oh, I thought we were going to do that. Brunch heads haven't woken up yet. I'm obsessed with these chicken lettuce cup things. Her wig was coming off. She said, I just got so annoyed with it. I just got so upset with it. She said, so she said she started wearing wigs, you know. Yeah. And she's like, it got ridiculous, so my wig would be sliding off, so then I would put on a, a beanie to keep the wig on. Oh, so she was, well, she said, I had braids, a wig cap, wow. a wig, and a beanie wow. to work out. She's like, this is, what am I doing? Like, this is Why ridiculous. are you forcing that on yourself? Yeah. But the problem with that story is, I was like, oh, empowerment, empowerment. I want to shave my head, too. And so other people comment, and they're like, y'all know why she's acting like this. They're like, she, she hates her blackness. Oh, people! They're like she hates her blackness because she's biracial. She had a white mom. Her white mom didn't teach her how to do her hair, and da, 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 da. she's made comments about black features and stuff like that. And I was like, people are so oppressed to feel oppressed, right? But my thing is, if you do like one hairstyle, people talk, if you straighten your hair, people talk about you. If you go natural, people talk about you. Or your hair's nappy, your hair's too straight, and you want it to be like you're white, and like yeah. it's like you, you can't win. Literally. But, I mean, that's just too much. I couldn't have stood out. I've done it before. Spell it out. Ari. 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 Ari.
what you have is what's beautiful. Because right. I feel like the pendulum always like swings in like one direction or another. Right. It's like now black women are like, oh, if like I have my hair relaxed and I can't like right. book work on TV because right. I just want the natural curly hair and a specific yeah. texture too. Why can't you guys just accept our diversity? Right. The fact that we're yeah. not a monolith. Yeah. There's a difference. Diversity. Yeah. And I feel like a really good example of that. Is Black Lady Scratch Show and it's a black lady. I love all the different hairstyles yes. that they have it, on that show. It's some, a black woman can do her hair any kind of way. Yeah. She wears short and curly. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. We, have we have that. Yeah. yeah. You can wear braids. The versatility. You can wear, locks, you yeah. can wear any kind of shade. Yeah, my thing is that can we just get to the point where like all of those styles are considered beautiful and it's not yes. like one specific yeah. aesthetic I mean, again, for yes. like. Oh, my earring back. Well, that's my thing is like, like I'll straighten my hair and I like it for a little while, but then I miss my curly hair, you and then like I will that. like. I see that about yeah. you. I. And then I'll like have my hair curly for a while and I'll miss my straight hair. There's the diversity in you. You can go either way. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, it took me a long time to like actually feel confident and comfortable with both, and there are definitely like times really? where like I do not feel beautiful with curly hair and I but I think that that is just like that entrenched yeah. mentality you didn't think you was beautiful with curly hair no and the sad part is wow. the, 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 the perception wouldn't. from other people because I think your natural curly hair is so beautiful yeah. I, 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 I usually love. I feel different like hair volumes and stuff that changes the way that your face shape I looks that. I and I think that. I'm just insecure about my face shape I think that's just the what happened? I don't think you have more of a heart shaped face. I don't think you have a round shaped face. Yeah, I mean, it also just depends on like where I am weight wise, too, and like yeah. Yeah, wait how healthy I, I am. Alrighty, so that was brunch. Now I am heading home to finally take these braids out. I am so tired of them. I just want these off my head, so let's do that. So I'm literally like three pounds lighter now uh this this all of this is on my head <laughs> um now that i finally have this out i've got to detangle obviously um just weigh it down with conditioner <laughs> and let it just hydrate a little bit wash and blow dry and then at some point this weekend we are going to deal with those roots but i'm tired so that point is not right now obviously so i think i'm gonna chill for the rest of the day um probably practice ukulele a little bit i i was on facetime with my niece wow okay donking moment <laughs> um i was on facetime with my niece and so i played her a little bit of what i've been learning so that was kind of fun um and i did my live stream which you guys would have seen a couple days ago so that was fun too um gosh this light is so bomb i'm like i should shoot some kind of tiktok video or something but I think first I'll get something to eat, relax, watch a little TV. It's Saturday, guys. I, I didn't work all week. I just need a little bit of downtime, so. Well, judge me if you want. That's your prerogative. prerogative. <laughs> but I will not be judging myself, so. Yeah, I will catch in with you guys a little bit later today. Hey, cuties. It's time to go to bed. Um, It's been a fun little day. I got some stuff done that I want to get done and other things that I didn't get a chance to, but that's okay. It's Saturday, and Saturdays are meant to be a little bit lazy. And I just dropped my classes on the floor, but it's fine. Um, that's the end of another beautiful day. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I love spending time with you. I just want you to know that you are so seen and heard and loved. And I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll be seeing you soon. Bye!